congratulations, eighth grade. Good luck the next four years. We know you'll do great. Make sure you come back and visit us. Hi, eighth grade class 2020. I'm so proud of all of you. I thought I would send you off with a little shamrock blessing. May your blessings outnumber the shamrocks that grow. And may trouble avoid you wherever you go. Congratulations. Woo! You made it. Congratulations, eighth grade. Mr. Rice coming at you. I just want to say congratulations and best of luck. I know you'll do well. I want to give a special shout out to the baseball team. Boys, there's no doubt in my mind, Dublin Kaufman baseball will be dominant for years to come. Go Rocks. Bye, eighth graders. I know you're going to go on and have a great time in high school, but we're really going to miss you. Bye. Thank you for making my first year teaching at Cells so special. You were a wonderful class. We made so many memories and I'm going to miss you so much. I hope for bright things for you in the future and I hope that you come and visit me. Hey, eighth graders. I know this isn't the end of the eighth grade year that you thought you guys were going to have, but I just wanted to say congratulations and good luck and make sure you go out there and do amazing, amazing things. Remember to work hard, be nice, and do the right thing. Congratulations, eighth graders, on the well-deserved success. I know this year was a little crazy, but you guys pushed through, worked hard, and I'm so proud of each and every one of you. Uh, good luck in high school. I know you guys are gonna do great things. Reach for the stars. Hi, eighth graders, this is Mrs. Longwell. I just wanted to say how great it was to get to know you this year. We will miss you so much. Please come visit, and we know you're going to do amazing things in high school. We love you and be safe and good luck. I am so proud of all you eighth graders and can't wait to see what you guys do in the future. See you in high school. In all seriousness, guys, I'm gonna miss you so much and I wish you the best of luck in high school. Hi, Cells 8th grade class of 2020, Mrs. Keck here. I just wanted to take a second and let you all know what an absolute pleasure it has been getting to know you and to be your art teacher these last three years. Congratulations, moving on to the high school. You did it! Hey, Cells 8th grade, Mr. Burner here. Uh, you've been one of the best 8th grade classes we've ever had. Uh, what a bummer to end the year the way we did. You are missed, but we wish you nothing but the best as you go on to high school. Congratulations, eighth graders. You're gonna do great things in the future. I know it. Good luck. Hey, class of 2024. Just wanna say huge congratulations. Listen, I have so many stories and jokes and laughs from you guys that I will remember forever. Just because you're on to high school doesn't mean you're off the hook. Come back and visit us. Thank you for a great school year. I miss your positivity, your energy, and all of your smiling faces. You have all adjusted to quite a lot of change this year, from me teaching in a chair in the front of the classroom and wheeling around on a scooter, to now finishing your eighth grade year with virtual learning. You have been forced some journey that no one expected. In the end, this will all make you stronger adults. I wish you all the best in high school. Good luck and best wishes. All right, guys, I'm gonna miss you. Don't forget to check in every so often, okay? Good luck. Eighth grade, it's Mrs. Wolf, and I just wanted to wish you all really well as you move on to the next chapter in your life. I am so proud of each and every one of you. I have loved watching each of you grow as individuals over the last three years, and I just wanna say congratulations on finishing eighth grade and best wishes as you move into high school. For our eighth graders, it has been a strange but outstanding year. Before we say goodbye to you and before we look into the future, I want to look back at what this class has accomplished this year and during their time here at Cells. 35 of you have finished your middle school career with a 4.0 GPA. Because of this, you all will be receiving the Principal's Award. We are also going to recognize those students who have been nominated to receive one of the four Legacy Awards. These awards recognize outstanding leadership in the classroom and on the field, character and overall citizenship. 16 of your classmates will be honored as recipients of the Ken Kaiser Character Award, the Norman Tarpley Citizenship Award, the Leadership Award, and the Archie Griffin Award. We are so proud of the accomplishments of this class and so excited that this class has continued 
the strong legacy and traditions that have been established. The legacy of the class of 2024 will remain forever at Sells. Yeah, you can be the greatest, you can be the best, you can be the King Kong banging on your chest. You can beat the world, you can beat the war, you can talk the guy go banging on his door. You can throw your hands up, you can beat the clock, you can move a mountain, you can break rocks. You can be a master, don't wait for luck. Dedicate yourself and you go find yourself. You can run the mile You can walk straight through hell with a smile You could be the hero You could get the gold Breaking all the records They thought never could be broke Yeah, do it for your people Do it for your pride And you're never gonna know If you never even try Do it for your country Do it for your name Cause there's gonna be a day When you're standing in the hall of fame yeah. And the world's gonna Buena suerte en Kaufman y por favor vuelvan a visitarme. Good luck at Kaufman. Make sure you come back and visit. We miss you already. Adios. We miss you, eighth graders. Good luck in high school. Come back and visit. Hi, Sal's eighth graders. This is Mrs. Schaefer. I'm wishing you a very fond farewell from Sal's Middle School and best of luck as you move on to all of your next adventures. So proud of the students that you've become over the last three years and wishing you all the best in the future. Take care. Hello, eighth grade, Pro Sick here. We've missed seeing you at school and I hope you guys have a great summer and I wish you the best at high school. Hey, eighth grade, Mrs. Francis here. Just wanted to wish you all the very best of luck next year in high school. We're gonna miss you. Hi, eighth graders. Um, it has been a true pleasure to get to work with and learn with and grow with all of you for the past year or so. And even for some of you, two years together, um, I will greatly miss all of you next school year and I wish you the best of luck wherever your high school adventures take you. Have a great summer. Hey, eighth grade class, it's Mrs. Kern. I wanted to wish you a congratulations as you move from middle school to high school. Good luck. Hello, eighth graders. I wanted to let you know how proud I am of you and how much I will miss you. I loved you in sixth grade and I've loved watching you grow these last two years. I've loved the constant hellos that I get every day. I've missed them these last couple of months, but remember that I'm proud of you and I'm thinking of you. Hey, Sales Class of 2020. I wanted to thank you for an amazing school year and I hope you all have a great summer. Hi, eighth graders, Ms. Jackson here. I'm so sad to see you guys go, but I know you're gonna do amazing things in high school. You are gonna be so, so missed. Don't be a stranger. Hi, eighth graders. I just wanted to congratulate you on all of your hard work at Cells and tell you that I've really enjoyed getting to know so many of you this year, and I wish you the best of luck in high school. I have so many amazing memories of your class, and I'm so sad that we did not get the opportunity to really say goodbye to each other. 
But I want you to know how much each of you mean to me, especially 7-3. And I hope you guys have a great summer. And when you're in high school, take a second to stop by cells and say hello. Good luck, guys. What's up, 8th graders? We're going to miss you. It's been a good run of three years. Remember, work hard, be nice, and do the right thing. Good luck at Kaufman. To our 8th grade class, uh, we just want to say congratulations. You've made it through middle school. Um, best of luck next year when you start high school. Um, Kaufman is lucky to have you. Um, please keep in touch with us and let us know all the amazing things that you're doing and um, have a great summer. Hey, eighth grade, Mrs. Hayes here. Just wanted to wish you well as you move on to high school. Lots of great memories with all of you. Farewell and good luck. Hi, eighth graders. I just wanted to say I'm going to miss you so much. I know you guys are gonna do awesome in high school. You guys were such a great class, so much fun, so many great leaders, and I know they're so lucky to have you wherever you go next. Have a great summer and good luck. Not your ideal ending to your eighth grade, but you've all been ideal students. Best of luck at Kaufman. Eighth grade class, this is Mr. Santama, your assistant principal for the last three years and the assistant principal at John Sells Middle School for the last 14 years. Good luck in high school and all of you will do great. Go Rocks. Hi eighth graders. I wish we were sending you off to high school in person. I will always remember your class as the first that I traveled to DC with. Shout out to Bus 6. And I hope that you are all doing well, staying safe and healthy that you have a great summer, and I know that you will love your freshman year of high school. See you soon. I hope you all have been enjoying our video presentation so far as we continue to celebrate the Class of 2024's 8th Grade Awards Assembly. This episode, unfortunately, is known as the one where they were quarantined. I am delivering my remarks from my den, which has served as my office for the last nine weeks. Although this is a virtual edition of our time to celebrate the children, it has remained a very important aspect that I wanted to pursue and keep. First, I would like to thank my colleagues. Your teachers and my fellow principals have been nothing but remarkable during this time. All of them are so disappointed at how this school year has ended. There is nothing like celebrating the end of a successful school year. Each of them have worked tirelessly to engage you with your learning and to connect with you, even though it may have been done through a camera attached to your Chromebook. What they did learn though through all of this is that you all do your best work between 12 and 3 a.m. Nonetheless, they carry the, the care they demonstrated for you all was clearly evident every day. They love all of you and are just as sad that this school year is ending in such a weird way. When I joined Cells five years ago, I was told that this was a very special place. During my time here, I witnessed exactly why this is true. This pandemic did nothing more than to bring out the greatness that is the, the best of our middle school staff. Overall, this teaching staff has had the opportunity to positively impact you in and out of the classroom since the first day of your sixth grade year. We have been able to spend the last three years getting to know each other. This group of students is one of the nicest groups of students I have met in quite a long time. I have had the privilege of getting to know you in the classroom, outside the classroom, on our DC trips, and everywhere else that we were able to interact. You all have made an, a lasting impression on your teachers and we are going to miss you all. I know that when we tell Kaufman this class is outstanding, we will be nothing but genuine with our description and words we choose to describe you. I have also challenged you to be proud of the fact that you are a rock. And I have challenged you all to believe in yourself and be proud of what you represent. My goal when you started here at Cells was to instill a sense of pride in you. The day I met you, when, you're really still, when you were really still just fifth graders, I gave you your first sales t-shirt. I wanted nothing more than for you to wear your new gear with pride. Further, I wanted, to, wanted you to never hesitate to tell other students from other schools how proud you were of the school. 
I also challenge you to reflect on the legacy you would leave behind once you all moved on. How will your teachers remember you? I would hope that each of you would want your teachers, both all 6th, 7th, and 8th grade teachers, to smile when they think about your class. I believe you have accomplished this goal. You, set, you are now set to embark on a new challenge. All of you are wading into the waters that is high school. There will be new challenges, new choices with bigger risks and new people that you will face each and every day. High school will feel better and it will definitely look bigger. My question to each of you is simple. How will you carry on the idea of rock pride and demonstrate the ability to be nice, work hard, and do the right thing? And how well did your one word provide guidance to you during your time away from school. These values should not be shed when you walked out of the school for the last time. These ideas should carry forward. And remember, the true test of your character is that you should be able to do the right thing even when you believe no one is watching you. The idea of rock pride is simple, but at times it can be the most difficult set of values to maintain. I encourage you all to have the confidence with yourself to pursue your goals. Do not let influences that can distract you and keep you from reaching what it is you want to achieve. And when you set these goals and dreams, be bold. Do not settle. Do not sell yourself short and be confident. Each of you has it in them to accomplish such great things. But will you take the ideas of Rock Pride with you, or will this just be a middle school thing? My hope for each of you is that you use these ideas that you know very well and combine them with the ideas your high school administrators are going to introduce to you. In doing so, you will be grounded in a core set of values that will serve you well as you get started on your next adventure. How will the legacy of the class of 2024 ultimately be remembered? they will be remembered as those who were bold, daring, and confident. And really what I believe most importantly is that this class remained true to themselves. The support system is in place. Your teachers, friends, and mostly important, your parents are there to support you during this time. You have that family support and they will do whatever it is you need to reach your goals and they will definitely be your biggest cheerleaders. So make them proud. Eighth graders, we want nothing more than for each of you to be successful as you can during your high school years. We are so excited to see what great things will come from all of you. You have left your mark and your legacy here at Sells Middle School. It is now in place. That is your legacy is now in place. Now, how will you leave your mark in high school? With everything you do, I hope that the idea of rock pride continues to ring in your ears. Thank you guys. You have been tremendous class and I wish you nothing but the best. Everybody, how you doing? Welcome to Kaufman High School. Uh, I see you made a little trip over here and we're excited to see you. I'm very excited to see you and can't wait for you to come next year. Uh, very hopeful that we will get back to normal and you will be able to uh, visit Kaufman High School and, and get used to it. I know uh, if you get a chance to walk around, you're going to see it's a big place and can be intimidating, but um, I think you will get the hang of it very quickly as most uh, freshmen do. Uh, maybe a little untraditional as you come next year with orientation. We're not sure how that's gonna work, uh, but we'll certainly put something together for you so you are uh, welcome and ready. I'm excited to have you. Uh, I've talked to Mr. Sockleben and he is very excited about your class and has nothing but great things to say about you. Um, and so uh, I'm very proud of you as well and uh, very proud to have you coming to Kaufman High School. I know you're going to love our staff and love our building. 
Um, we, we do our best to create a great environment and uh, just looking very forward to seeing you. And I wanna congratulate you on a successful eighth grade year uh, and looking forward to have you at Kaufman. So thanks for stopping by and I hope you guys have a great rest of your trip and I hope you have a great summer and we'll see you before you know it. Thank you.